Hey guys, what is going on? So today, we're back. We're officially back. Um, start of summer was a little bit rough. Um, didn't go as planned, so I got off track. Everything that got messed up. Went through a little bit of a rough time. But we're back working out. Weight's better than ever. Um, physique's getting there. Haven't been cutting for too long. Um, yeah, was was gonna do it. Worked the foot, got back on it, got off, and now we're back on. So for about a month, we're just gonna not a super hard cut. Just try to lean up a little bit before winter um, or the fall, I guess. Um, and yeah, get back into YouTube and get back into what we actually enjoy doing. Um, got really caught up in just you know life and kind of what people expect out of you, and I start following that so. You know what? Fuck it. We're gonna do what we want. So, we got a workout going today. Actually, gonna take you guys along on this one, like I said I was a couple months ago. Finally, gonna take you guys with me. Um, it's gonna be either a chest and shoulder day or a chest and tri day. Not too sure which one we're doing yet. Um, but we'll decide when we get to the gym. Working out with my brother, as I said, he just started um, a couple days ago, so really excited for him. Um, he went, we went once, did really good, and you know the best thing is when people start working out. Uh, you know that they're actually going to commit to it if if they want to go back. That's usually doesn't happen. They usually don't want anything to do with it after they work out. Um, but he went back on his own. Like, that's crazy. Good props to him. Uh, I'm really proud of him. So, um, I guess I'm his official personal trainer, um, coaching him. You know, doing his calories, all that kind of stuff, macros. Um, so yeah, just helping him get back in shape. Um, I'm glad he came to me. Everything like that. So, we're gonna hit a workout with him today, and I'll record it with you guys. And I'll probably do a voiceover and just kind of give you guys some tips. Um, it's going to be nice, I'm going to be making a lot of workout videos now because since he's a beginner, um, it's kind of what this channel is geared toward and what it was, so we're just going to keep following that, do a lot of beginner workouts with him, and uh, yeah, we're going to have a blast doing it, so I'll see you guys when we're in the gym. Alright guys, so diving into this workout, first uh, movement that we have is the decline bench press, and couple things to note on this is one elbows are going out we're almost making L's with our arms and that's just gonna put emphasis on the chest if your arms are pretty straight with your body um, that's more working our triceps so we want to go out wide with our elbows to work our chest and really squeeze when we get to the top of that with our chest um, to ensure that we're getting the most work out of our chest um, so on to the next exercise um, so that's kind of like the strength builder of the workout, um, working our lower chest, you know, the pressing movements, the bench press is going to really build strength in our chest. So now it's on to more into finding the chest. Um, as you can actually see in this picture, uh, my chest looks a lot better in this one. Uh, but so this is pec flies. Um, we did four sets of 15 on these. Um, high rep, high rep on these. Um, and really just the biggest thing to ensure on this is just make sure that you're keeping your arms at a constant position and you're not letting the weight drag you down. You want to be in control of the weight the whole time. Um, it's going to give you a lot better chest pump. And also you want the weights to be a little bit lower than your chest um, to put even more emphasis on the chest. So now we move on to a chest press. Um, this is going to work the upper chest and the front delts. Um, really good workout, really good um, you know, definition builder. Um, two major things is, as you can see, I'm pausing at the bottom, which just uh, helps with chest development. And also at the top, I'm not going all the way extended. I'm going slightly um, below extended. Um, and this is going to keep all the tension on your chest instead of transferring it at the end to your triceps. Um, you can try this out and feel it. So next we move on to just the standard pec fly. Um, two things to notice. One, how I grabbed it. Um, it saves a lot of energy. You guys can go back and look at it. Um, as opposed to sitting down and grabbing all the way back and really tearing up your chest um, if you just grab it with your body or like that you can use your body to actually grab it and save energy um, and also the grip on here I just feel like it gives me a better pump in my chest you guys can try it um, 
But again, you know, high reps, 10 to 12 for four sets. Okay, so that concludes all the chest workouts. That was four chest movements. Um, my chest was pretty tapped after this, honestly, guys. Um, so next we move on to tricep pull downs with the rope and the um, pulling um, away at the end. Um, this really puts emphasis on your... Oh, man, I really don't know the names of the heads of triceps, but that outside head, as you can see it working there. Um, and I really like to go high rep when I do triceps just because I feel like I get a lot okay. better uh, form out of it and I get a better pump. So that's just my personal preference. Next up, we're going on to tricep kickbacks. And this is one of my favorite tricep workouts. Not really the pump I get from it. It's just fun to watch yourself do it and flex your tricep. Um, but really these look like skiing man. So pretty much what you're gonna do is you're just gonna bend over parallel to the ground with your body. Um, and just kick back those triceps and flex them. So we really hit that outside tricep muscle hard on this workout. That was, that those, both those workouts really hit those hard. So now we're moving on to an ab workout to conclude the workout. Um, I usually rotate my cardio and ab days. I usually just flip flop back and forth. Um, it makes it easy and doesn't let me get off track with it. Um, so every other workout, you know, I'll be doing abs. Um, Mondays, I have like a body weight day where I just do cardio, abs, and then like pull-ups and push-ups and that kind of thing. But for this workout, we're doing just your basic crunches. And, you know, when people do sit-ups and all these things where they're just moving around a lot, um, really the abs do not stretch that far, guys. Um, when you're doing sit-ups, after you go past the point where I was doing my, my um, crunches, on the floor it's all back after that you're not working your abs at all so there's no point in going like that and two slow down when you're doing abs abs is a lot of breathing so at the top of this when I pull my legs up I'm or um so let's see so I'm breathing in at the bottom and then squeezing my abs when I get to the top when I get to that crunch motion that's when you exhale completely and flex and that's just gonna give you a better workout so we did that. Um, not really sure what the things I just did were called. They work your lower abs. You can also do them sitting on a mat and just pull them right to your chest when you're laying down. And then now we're going on to some, we called them Russian twist in baseball. I've heard a couple of different names, but I'm just gonna call them Russian twist. Um, and these are just to work our obliques. Now, the lower that you sit on that is gonna work your obliques harder. So that was the workout. Um, early in the morning, just by myself, <laughs> just getting away. Um, I think it's important, that's like lifting too, I think it's important just to have, you know, at least one day a week where, you know, if you always work out with somebody, that's great, but just have one day a week where you just go in by yourself, you know, throw on the headphones, and just, you know, focus on yourself. Don't focus on anybody else. Focus on yourself, get better yourself, you know, practice and you know really just execute and focus that day um i love days like that so that's what we're doing then we're gonna hit a workout right after that so um yeah it should be an interesting day so take you guys along with me not in the workout unfortunately i'm not working out with anybody today i need to get a tripod i don't even know if this camera has a tripod place but um we'll find something to work so see you guys at the golf course Alright guys, so just had a killer workout. My legs are toast. Uh, I'm just gonna end this, I don't know what to call them, episode, series, I, episode, end this episode. <laughs> Alright guys, uh, I'll see you on the next one. Probably vlog tomorrow, maybe later. Tomorrow's an off day for me, so we'll see. So, hope you guys enjoyed it, and I will see you next time. Have a great day, more importantly, make somebody else's day even better.